Hello and welcome to another video by Gardensite.co.uk. Today we're going to be looking at some more hose lock products. What we're looking at today is hose locks the range of filter come pumps called the Easy Clears. These range of pumps incorporate a filter, a pump and an ultraviolet light, helping to keep the conditions of the pond better for the fish and keeping the clarity better for people to be able to see the fish in the pond. First in the range of these pumps, these, uh, pumps is the Easy Clear 3000. Compact design to them. They come complete with an ultraviolet light built in, as I was saying, um, sponges and a built in pump. This is the smallest one, which is an Easy Clear 3000. It'll say it has a capacity of treating ponds up to a maximum of 660 gallons. That is in ideal conditions. So if your pond was in a very well lit area, when I say well lit, I mean bright sunny area, then you would need to actually reduce the figure. We usually say on average about half. So if it's a very sunny area that your pond is in, then this one's only going to treat about 330 gallons. Now, if you also have a large stocking level, now stocking level sometimes can be large through the number of fish or through having koi carp. Large numbers of fish produce large amounts of waste. Koi carp being larger than most fish will produce large amounts of waste. This will also factor into the amount that the filter can treat. Also, whether you've got a lot of plant life in the pond. If you have a lot of plant life in the pond, be it marginals, lilies, oxygenating plants, they can help to actually filter the water slightly to a degree. So if your pond is quite low in plant life, then this will be working harder. If it's quite high in plant life, not so much work. Past the point where the pond starts to become kind of clogged with plants. Okay, next thing we'll do is get this out and we'll have a look at it for you. First thing obviously would be the instructions, keeping them safe to one side. Your guarantee slip uh, and your warrant, well, what they class normal now is your warranty card to fin uh, fill in and send off back to hose lock. Any problems with any guarantee claims, you do bring the products back to where you brought them from, but um, best to always fill in your warranty slips. Fittings. From one of the previous videos, you may have seen some similar fittings to these for the cascades. We'll be running through these again anyway. And there we have the Easy Clear 3000. 10 metres of cable. A couple more fittings. Uh, and with uh, most of the hose lock products as well, being the pumps, uh, there's a three year guarantee on this. Right, firstly, we'll go to the fittings. Again, from previous videos, you may have seen the ones we've mentioned about the fountain heads, but just in case you haven't, we'll cover them again. Two top main types of fountain heads. One with less holes will produce a much higher fountain. One with more holes will produce a wider spread. All you need to do to pick which one you want, just clip them into the top of the fountain head. And when we've assembled the fountain assembly, you can pop that into the top of it. The other fountain head that you can choose from are the bell jets. These ones, some people call them mushrooms, some people call them bell jets. It comes out in a dome effect, which is adjustable by how far this implement is placed into the top. The further in it goes, the more the bell jet starts to come out to the point where the water will actually come out straight if you put it in too much. Next, these are designed to operate in slightly larger ponds and slightly deeper ponds then maybe some of the smaller cascade range of pumps we've looked at in the previous video. As such, you assemble these. Now, when assembling them, you will note that this piece in the top tends to be loose. It's adjustable, tighten up from the top knot. Top nut. So, give it a bit of a tighten to hold it in place while you're putting these parts on. There's four of these supplied with it. And just merely keep screwing them into it till you get the desired depth for your pond. Again with hose lock, they have thought of a lot of things. If your pond is uneven, as I mentioned with this nut here and you tighten it up, you can adjust your fountain head to create an even spray. If you don't have that level, the spray can kind of go over to one side. We'll leave those two off for now. Back to the fountain head, pop the fountain head onto there, and that's the assembly of it. As I mentioned at the start, there is an ultraviolet light. We'll cover that much later on in the video. It's already inside this unit, so it's built into the inside of there. 
We'll cover maintenance and how you can actually get at that and how you can clean the sponges out as well. The principal design for all the Easy Clears is the same. They just end up being slightly larger and slightly more capacity on the bulb and the pump side. If you do want this to run just a small water feature like a waterfall, they also provide another fitting. This fitting will screw on top in place of the fountain extensions. And this takes one inch pipe. That's 25 mil internal diameter pipe. Put the pipe ones there. Always with any pipe fittings we recommend Jubilee Clipper. The last thing you want is for a pipe to come off and to empty your pond. But you can run some pipe onto there and run up to a, say, a small waterfall. It's got a reasonable capacity pump but I wouldn't want it to pump any more than say like a, a couple of metres at the most and just cascade back down through a small waterfall. As you can see here, we've assembled the range of Easy Clears. Just so you can see them all together, get an idea of the sizes of them. What we're going to do now is just run over a few key points of each one. Starting with Easy Clear 3000. The power consumption on this one is 25 watts. It has a maximum flow of 277 gallons per hour. It can handle ponds approximately about 660 gallons. That is depending on the actual load on the pond, as we mentioned earlier on in the video. The ultraviolet light contained inside here, as we mentioned about the maintenance, uh, so you've seen it from the previous in the video. That's a 5 watt ultraviolet light. Moving on to the Easy Clear 6000, the power consumption on this one is 40 watts. It has a maximum flow of 374 gallons per hour. It can cope with a pond approximately 1,320 uh, 1, gallons. And the ultraviolet light built inside here is a 9 watt. And then the biggest one in the range, the Easy Clear 9000. The power consumption on this one is 55 watts. It has a maximum flow of 627 gallons per hour. It can handle a pond approximately 1,980 gallons. And the ultraviolet light built inside here is a 13 watt. With all of them, they come with 10 metres of cable, a three year guarantee, and as you will notice when you get open it up, the cable has no plug on it. They are exempt by law from having to have a fitted plug to actually make people get a, a, consult a qualified electrician to get them installed. Uh, and that covers most of the key points on the range of the EasyClears. Thanks for watching a video by gardensite.co.uk.